Hey, what's up YouTube? I am Mikobor and this is the third part of my video week of 24 basics. In this video I will finish covering all the weapons in Call of Duty 4 with sniper rifles. Okay, we will start with this similar sniper rifle that is a bow action rifle with five shots. Okay, is the best bow action rifle when using a stopping power on it. Of course, it's the f it's my favorite sniper rifle in Call of Duty 4. Okay, if you want to be a sniper in Call of Duty 4, you have one golden rule. That golden rule is one shot, one kill. Anything less, and you might as well be using an assault rifle. Okay, this sniper rifle is the M21. This one is a semi automatic sniper rifle. It is well known because it's the best sniper rifle to use on a hardcore match. Why? Because it's small reload. Like in that shot over there, I did like three shots. And I guess you just not feel like to. Well, it's also good to use in normal matches. Or always aiming to the particular parts of the human being. You know. Okay, this one is the dragon loop. The dragon. <laughs> this one is a very interesting sniper rifle. Damage that the Dragon Loop applies for a normal player is usually outclassed by the other sniper rifles, except when using no stopping power perks. Cause if you use stopping power on this, you won't get a one shot kill. When not using it, you won't get it. So, this sniper rifle gives you an open two option that maybe you can use like overkill there and have like a zoom machine gun to defend yourself and not to and you will be a very <laughs> very interesting play to see okay the dragon this one you can get it to call camouflage but in all my PC Call of Duty for Life I never saw someone with call camouflage in that web. Okay, now I have the other ball action rifle on Call of Duty 4 for you. This one is the Air 700. The Air 700. It lower bullet capacity than the M4 A3 because you know here you just have 4 shots that also the one thing the air, the air 700 has going for it is it's higher damage multiplier for stomach shots so if you like to shoot to the stomach of the other players, and this is definitely a weapon for you. Another thing is a practical advantage, except for making it slightly easier to one shot enemy with huge cost. I mean, shooting to the stomach is pretty easy. Now, this is the powerful sniper rifle we call 24. This is the Barrett point fifty call. The best semi-automatic sniper rifle when using a stopping power. Whatever or not, the Barrett is better than the M4VA3. It's a matter of opinion. But the weapon are very that weapons are very similar. I mean the recall of this weapon is like huge. And when I say huge is huge. Very big, you know you want to throw your shot after with this sniper rifle you know personally i prefer the 
barred because of its scent of close quarters. When I say I prefer it is on semi-automatic. Now look at that shot. That's my first double kill with a sniper rifle that I recovered. Okay, give me give me credit for it, okay. Yeah. Well now you are ready for it man. You, there is nothing you will find strange in Call of Duty 4 Reflex. Okay, before I let you go, I want to give you some tips in these tips are always aim for the upper body. I mean if you are aiming an enemy you don't want to shut his legs okay you want to shut him to the upper body okay the second tip is use the high ground I don't know why but when you are high ground when you are up to say a thing, few words you ha you feel like you are on an advantage I don't know why it is it to kill someone if you are up him okay now the third tip I want to talk about is a stay to the perimeter if you go into the center of the map I mean that's a, a dead trap okay you don't want to do that cause it will keep you like your dead you want to do is what you want to do is go to the edges you know never to the center of the map because you get killed is okay then other one is use your special grenade if you're going to get in a room you don't want to surprise everybody you want to flash them out first and then get in the other one is have your crop you don't want to be running around around sprinting for all the map because you will get killed you have to be very sure that you are not being followed okay you have to use your teammate it's not the same if you are against one kind than if you if you and a teammate are against one kind is very diff is very different okay the next tip is use right tool for the job that means like use the exactly the correct classes in weapons to a very singular map for example you don't want to get a a sniper rifle on a small map you know okay the next thing is knife knife people off okay you, you have the knife remember it hey you got knife okay you have to knife people cause it's faster okay and my last tip is experiment with different classes of tips that means you you don't want to be like in cover defined you, how many of you have the mp40 with round drum the as their first class i mean almost everybody you, you can you can be a good player and call to the fight you don't have the mp4 in one of your classes i mean you have to try new things well this is this has been all i hope you enjoy my my tutorials and I will probably upload some gameplay okay of Call of Duty 4 some some touches well it has been a pleasure Richard 4 slash Miko 4 say bye bye guys take care and we will see you in modern warfare reflex see ya Cause sometimes you just feel tired, feel weak